Delicious noodles. Great embracing comfort food. Will there be enough? Find out tonight on this episode of Dad the Noob Tries to Make Beef Ramen. Konnichiwa. Wa. Watashi. Dad the Noob. Imasu. Hello, I'm Dad the Noob. We're doing beef ramen. So we just got done chopping the onion, separating the white from the green. And now I'm gonna cut this ginger. You're supposed to peel the ginger. I'm supposed to peel the ginger? Yes. Well, how am I supposed to peel the ginger? With the peel? Yes. Oh. All right. Sorry. All right. Now we have the ginger. <laughs> Very powerful. Gingers are powerful, even though they're so soulless. <laughs> Just kidding. Much love to my, all my redheaded viewers out there. And this is the base stock. I know it doesn't look like a whole lot, but then we're gonna throw the beef broth in there, and then we're gonna throw the vegetables in there and let that simmer while we wait for our steak to cook, and then we're gonna chop it up, and then we're gonna toss it all in, let it cook for a little bit longer, and then we're gonna do the noodles, and then it should be done. It doesn't look too appetizing, but believe it, when you see it, when I drain those noodles, this gets poured in, and I hope it tastes something like ramen noodle, not like beef soup. So, arigato gozaimasu, and we'll catch you later. I go through a cycle, rinse and drain, rinse and drain, rinse and drain, rinse and drain. Hey, did you turn that down? Rinse and drain. Use the cool water to keep the noodles from sticking. As you can see, they look like udon noodles now. Thin udon noodles.
All right, Alyssa's tying her hair back. She's about to tackle the bowl of doom. Yes, you can. What do you think? Try it. What do you think? Try the meat. How is it? It's good. All right, you heard it here, folks. And Alyssa is a ramen connoisseur. From us to you, Kanbanwa, arigatou gozaimasu, and we'll catch you later.